Joining us now from Four Oaks is training and implementation coach Lindsay Murphy. And today we're talking about the idea of hope, science, and how being intentionally optimistic is good for people's stress levels and mental health. Thanks for being here today. Thank you. Well, you wanted to talk about the impact hope has on mental health. What does hope or hope science mean in that context? So hope is more than just a feeling, right? Hope is um, a belief in a brighter future and the ability to achieve that brighter future. Absolutely. And what can someone intentionally pursue hope or optimism? How can they do that? Um, there's a ton of ways. One is to surround your people with who surround yourself with people who are hopeful, right? Hope is contagious. Um, but a little more strategically, um, setting goals. And the biggest one is by connecting with other individuals. Yes, yeah, and taking action there. And what steps can someone take to building connections with other adults to achieve that hope? Um, absolutely. So, <clears throat> um, following your passions and interests. And so if you have an interest in painting, join a painting group, right? Join some of those different groups to surround yourself with other like-minded individuals. Um, goal setting is a huge part of building hope. And so um, set up goals that give you an opportunity to see small areas of success as well. Yeah, it helps to write them down and not doing something that you necessarily have to pay for either. Exactly. All right. And what can, how can someone teach a child how to do the same thing, routines or practices that you can put into place to teach children to choose hope and choose joy? Um, a lot of it is really modeling, right? And so t showing your kids, showing the kids that you are around how to make goals um, and how to achieve those goals. A really fun way to do it is to create a like summer bucket list, right? And get the child included in deciding what our goals are for the summer, how we want to get there, and it shows them how to reach that brighter future. Yeah, who doesn't want to be a little more happy? <laughs> Absolutely. Right, so important there. Yes. All right, Lindsay, thanks for joining us here today. Thank you so much. And stay with CV9. We'll be right back. Your